now. Have a great night, everybody. Hey, hey, food fans, it's time. I'm so glad you're here. It's your party and you can shop if you want to. Mm-hmm, I hope you're hungry because it's your kitchen. Okay, you know how you heard that phrase, no flipping? Oh, we want you to flip. Flip it good, flip it real good. Flip it when it's brown, then it's done. I'll tell you what, the flip pan is here. And not only is Mark Gill in the house, we got some great ideas for you. I actually made my dinner in four minutes, frozen shrimp on my stove top. And then, I don't know if you watched Marla's Good Eats show. I love that show. I'm always shopping with her every week. It's National Waffle Day. Who knew, right? In fact, Alexa, will you be my friend? I'm happy to be your friend. I'm inviting her to the party. I'm inviting you to the party. What's better than chicken and waffles? It's a waffle, it's a slider, it's a waffle, it's a slider, it's a waffle slider. This is just one of the recipes I'm gonna be posting this week. Of course, you're always the biggest part of this show. Thank you again. I, I just have so much fun when you guys are here. Oh, by the way, jumbo shrimp might be my favorite oxymoron in the world. This is just plain and jumbo. Because <laughs> there is nothing shrimp about it, except for that's pretty much all the ingredients. I have never, ever, ever seen anything quite like this in the food category. Not only is it unique, it's chemical free, it's practically all shrimp. And girls, if you count, I can count, you know, not much beyond my fingers, hands and toes. Two points, Coach Joe, two points. And then of course, uh, Mark Gill has a lot to do tonight. We're also gonna be outside uh, grilling and we're gonna be at our Blackstone Griddle. So it's almost like we're gonna have our own little food truck going on. And as I like to say, if there's not ice, nobody's happy because somebody has to go to that store. Somebody has to leave the event. Somebody's waiting to hear that snap, crackle, and fizz that still tastes all. like onions in your refrigerator. And again, even if you've seen some of the items in this show, we're gonna try to show you unique and fun ways to use them. She is unique. She is fun. <laughs> she is my fellow Minnesotan with the long O. <laughs> Rebecca Wood is back. And Rebecca, you know, I'm a huge Hi. fan of this. And I have to say, you guys made oh. it better. Oh, that's Hear the it? sound of a party, folks. <laughs> so I like you to do the honors. First and foremost, you just pick your color of choice. It's less than $30 on your credit card. We're paying for your shipping. We've got the white, the red, or this beautiful, we call I it love blue, blue, but it's like the jewelry box blue. Yes. So in a nutshell, you don't, you also get the cover. You don't need a drain line line, a plug, nope. special, you know, water, you know, installation. You, all you need is water and how much ice and how long? And in, in six to 15 minutes, depending on the size of ice that you want, you're going to have a full tray of ice. This takes you six or three hours, I should say, three hours, three hours for 24 ice cubes, or do you want ice in six to 15 minutes. Look at it, dumped it right in there. It's gonna go back and continue to make the next one. And all you need is a standard outlet. It is that simple. So when it comes home to you, you're gonna plug it in and then you're gonna add the water. That's all you have to do. That's it. That's it. You hey just Rebecca, take, yeah. any kind of water? Any kind of water. Any kind you're a water, of water snob, right? If I, I remember I am correctly. a water snob. Because I told Rebecca. That's the only kind of snob she is. I mean, she's the sweetest girl you ever met. Because honestly, you can use any water, but there's a particular brand of bottled yeah. water that I like. Hey, I want to ask you, do this too. So you just dump it you in. You dump it in there. It will hold about a gallon of water. About a gallon of water. So it will make a lot of ice before you even have to go so and babysit you, it. And then you just put the tray on top. The thing yep. that I found so surprising, I, I saw you talking about Guy with this uh, right before the weekend. So they're what? Little piston? What it, yes. How does it freeze so fast? I try to get a look, but it's really, really hard. There are these little, you've got these little rods in the back here that's going to flash freeze it. So not only are you going to get ice fast, it will be the best tasting ice you've ever had because it's flash frozen from the inside out, meaning it's gonna trap less impurities. So all you are tasting is water, not the leftovers right. that you're storing in your refrigerator next door. And you get choices. So you saw that I just filled it with water. Then you make your selections. You either will have the S for the small, the M for the medium, or the L for the large. And why do you want choices? Because you're gonna use them for different things. That small, it's gonna be wonderful if you want to have um, a smoothie and grind it to a smooth, smooth consistency. That medium is going to be wonderful if you're using it maybe for, here's the medium right there. That medium is going to be great if maybe for your buffets, anything that you want to showcase. That large though, 
You've got that whiskey you want to savor. Yes, you do. You've got that liquor you want to savor. That's going to be great. All of them, though, you can see, have that little indentation. Right. And why is that important? It's so important. And, and it's because it's going to give you more surface of the ice. Oh. So your drink actually cools down faster, but because they are all still one big chunk of ice, it's going to melt slowly. Does it water down your drink more? N no, in fact, it will make it so it will, because it melts slower, your drink will stay fresher longer, not a watered down version of it. L love it. So by the way, uh, a lot of the recipes and things that we're doing during this show, I hope inspire you with your party. As my friend Victoria knows, some of them are fun, some of them are easy, some are very bougie. So we have a bougie lavender lemonade oh, that I'll be yes. uh, posting a little bit uh, after the show. I did take a picture before the show so you guys can get a little bird's eye view view of what you can do at home. And I'll tell you, Rebecca, I don't care if it's the bougie fancy lemonade that you're making for your girlfriends to dress to impress, yes. or if it's just the slushy that you're making for your kids, or if you're doing shrimp cocktail, if you're any of those things, nothing happens without ice. I mean, that is, at the end of the day, Ice is nice, and this is less than $30 on your credit card. It's one of our favorite items in our kitchen family. And the thing about it is, too, Rebecca, it, it doesn't take up a big profile. And no. one of the things you do that I love, you know I've got back issues. I've had a lot of, you know, chronic pain this year, so I can't carry home the big bags of ice. They're heavy, they're cumbersome. They're heavy, they're cumbersome. so much space they in do. your refrigerator and, and freezer. And so this will do 28 yes. pounds. Yes, I want to show you what that looks we gotta like. we got to show that off. So remember, we're telling you no drain no water line needed just the water just a standard outlet so you can make ice anywhere your cabin your boat your rv even the back of your car i've got an adapter and when that hurricane yeah. hit i was able to make ice on demand when you could find nice nowhere in the tri-state no, region i mean it was gone it, everywhere it's really true by the way we are facebooking live alicia love to see you as always beth hello to you in southern california we have kind of bunk uh, bunk uh, you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I do, I can tell. <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. <laughs> Good to see you. Uh, Azuti, the Panatics are in the house. Lisa, hello to you. Sharon, hello to you. Selene, hello to you. She knows all my kitchen boos are oh, in the house. Oh, yes. And you know, the thing is, Rebecca, I think it's, it's one of those foregone conclusions. It's like you don't realize how much you appreciate the ice at your party until you run out. Mm -hmm. And you know what? It's more than just a party. It's things like if you are using it to maybe blanch vegetables, if you are using it in the cooking process, if you're using it for your high-end spirits, if you're also putting it in your smoothies, and I know that's a demonstration Rebecca's going to do, a lot of you watching this show, that's why I always try to give you some low-fat options for things as well, are watching gluten or sugars or what have you, but if I'm doing this, I could even do a smoothie and make, make it taste like dairy. It's yes, and that's what I can do for you right now just to show you because the, what happens is because you're not tasting anything being trapped in like you do with the typical uh, ice cubes, right. you're just tasting whatever you're putting into your smoothie. So in the morning, turn it on. About six minutes, you're going to get a full tray of ice. Put in that about six, six minutes. minutes. So Isn't let me tell crazy? you, when you first plug it in the Can very I first time. something, Rebecca? Yeah. I'm so sorry to, to interject, but I think it's an important comparison. So when you say in about six minutes, you have ice. Yes. How long does this do? This old guy, this old yeah. fashioned, six hours. Oh. Your refrigerator <laughs> okay. ice maker is three hours. Okay. Three hours. Six minutes, six hours. It's six crazy. Minutes, six hours. So you're going to add some ice, and then you're going to just add your favorite frozen fruit, whatever. <laughs> Whatever you like. Now, when you see, when we're done, the finished product, you're going to see that it looks like ice cream. You're going to swear that we added um, fresh cream you would. or yogurt because it whips to a creamy consistency. So I just want to point out there is no dairy no there, dairy guys. Whatsoever. By the way, Heidi, you are so cute. You make me smile. Sharon, I'm so glad we make you hungry. Hopefully, you've got a little snack when you watch the show. Uh, Joanne, I love you being here. Paula, you make me small, smile in the UK. Uh, Al, thank you. We try to give you lots of information. Selene, always good to see my kitchen booze. And honestly, Azuti saying, hey, you bourgeoisie, you, you bougie that lemonade, Miss Smith. And we yes. are. But you Look can bougie that. your smoothie. You can bougie your smoothie. If mm -hmm. you wanted to add your favorite um, protein powder, go ahead, do that. Otherwise, if you just want a really healthy, delicious treat, there's no dairy. 
It looks Isn't like wild? a sorbet. It is abs and taste it. It even tastes because it is whipped to a smooth consistency. It, it is. That's the small. Remember, that, for these, you're going to want to use the small. Absolutely. Hey, by the way, quick quantity update. If you want the red, you guys know I love my get arrested red. <laughs> and we have fewer than 100 of those to go around. We do have that great blue. It's kind of that jewelry box blue. You know what I'm talking about. And then the classic white as well. You are getting your storage right. cover, which I'm not sure how much you'll store it, but it's, it's nice to have. So that is in your color of choice, of course. And once more, in case you missed the presentation, any water, no drain line, no crazy installation, but you get ice in as little as six minutes from any kind of water, any kind, any of, kind water. of water, up to 28 pounds a day that you're not haul hauling home from the store. Right. And remember, because of that piston-driven system, mm -hmm. with that hole, it, it cools the drink faster, but it does not dilute the drink. And of course, it, it also, I think it's prettier. I know that's probably not why you're buying this, but it, is. it, it, it looks nicer. If you notice, you know, sometimes you actually look at ice and it looks, it's weird, but it looks like yeah. it's been, it's got the, the, the freezer burn. This, you'll never sure. see it. It's, it's true. just pure, gorgeous piece of ice, and it will taste that way it as will, well. It will, by the way, special credit card promotion. You know I love all you guys. I'm going to try to get to all, uh, all, all of my booze, my kitchen booze, my shanitas on hsn.com and Facebook Live. But we are doing two extra credit card payments if you have an HSN card. We also have an apply and buy promotion right now as well. We will pay to send this to you. It's less than $30 on your credit card. I'm so glad you could join our party. I know depending on where you're shopping, you're saying, I'm not going into the great outdoors yet but I'll tell you indoors outdoors you know covered porch area backyard this is a party in a box even my makeup artist uh, Carmel she had she hosted a birthday party for her little guy at a big park and she's like too we ran out of ice but they had outlets so you could take that right there with you right I'm telling you you're gonna get invited to every summer and and party you know Memorial Day 4th of July the whole nine yards because it's only 22 pounds it is. it's only 22 Crazy. pounds you just need a standard outlet Guess when I say maintenance, there's no maintenance. Underneath, on the yep. side, right here, in Absolutely. fact, I can show By you. By the way, the only caveat to our special promotion on FlexPay is this item, because we already maxed out at, at five. So you will get an extra one. So you'll get up to six on this. Otherwise, you're looking at two extra. Perfect. And I'll tell you, Rebecca, this is my kind of maintenance or installation. It is. It's perfect. You just plug it in to use it. No drain, no water line needed. If there's any water left over at the end of a party, you just simply unscrew that over the ground or a sink yes. and that's it that's it, all you have to do no filters brilliant nothing to ever have to worry about that and then the next time you're ready to go you push on six to 15 minutes you're ready to go with a full fresh tray of ice yeah the only other thing i want to say is once this it even tells you when it's full it will say ice full that means take it out right. put it into the freezer put it into yeah. an ice chest just so it can continue to right. make more and more and more makes sense hey by the way last 50 of the red and it's a really beautiful almost like a metallic like a luxury Candy autumn. Apple, candy, yeah, apple red, beautiful. the blue, the white, of course. Judy, hello to you. Sandy, always good to have you here. Judy's walking from Texas. Alicia, I'm keeping my fingers crossed for two hours as well. Linda and Sandy and William, uh, love you in Palmetto. Sonia and Al and all of you. Oh my, and speaking of oh my, Brian, the, the bougie lemonade recipe will be coming oh. very soon, Isn't my dear beautiful? friend. I've been Do you thinking see it of here? you, you know Look that, right? Look at how right? gorgeous it is. My favorite way though is iced coffee. In the morning I turn it on, six minutes later I have that full tray of ice, and I have the coffee, I, I am a coffee snob. You may be a water snob, I'm a coffee snob. Right. And I wanna just taste my coffee. I don't Absolutely. wanna taste the garlic that I had in dinner <laughs> last night. And you know very well, everyone has had that experience, right? You go to the refrigerator, and you take out the ice. Now remember, six minutes or six hours. Right. And it tastes like, you know, the bag of frozen vegetables <laughs> or what have you. By the way, William on Facebook Live, uh, it, it makes how much at a time? It makes about a pound and a half. About and a half a yes. time. So William, you will, it, it won't hold the 28 pounds of ice. That, that's nope. the only thing you have to do is take it out and put it in this your freezer. This is an ice maker, not an ice keeper is <laughs> what I like go. to say it. So put Rebecca, it in ice chest, you're ready to go. Thank you. Thank you. I'm inviting you to every party I have. You're bringing the ice. I always, I'll take it right off your shoulders and your <laughs> smile and sparkling personality which is you. priceless i love you uh, by the way no matter what the price our hsn card always has some great incentives including ten dollars off your purchase so we do have that apply and buy promotion going on hey we love having you here i i so appreciate you more than you even know you guys are family and so that's why we wanted to do some special party ideas for you and i don't know just saying go ahead and flip it 
flip it real good, makes me smile. I know who I'm inviting to my party because he cooks as good as he looks, Mark Gill. Oh my goodness, that's, I'm <laughs> you, not sure that that's you, a good you thing. You gotta live up to the standard. <laughs> you gotta live up to the standard. I we finally it. have a flip pan here at HSN, and many of you know this is a genius idea. Even if you've seen it elsewhere, this was done exclusively for us. Two quick things, you just pick your color of choice. We've got this great, kind of like a, a nice navy blue, our gray or our red. Mm -hmm. Mark's gonna take you on a tour of the details, but if you're not familiar with the concept, first and foremost, this is two pans in one, yes, it or is. three if you wanna look at it, because it has a unique seal that yes, Mark is gonna speak to. You can use it either as a grill pan or a straight little griddle. When you hook them together though, and I think we've got a little bit of animation, uh -huh. now, and again, easy to clean, easy to detach, but that Absolutely. seal, uh, Mark, I want to say this correctly. Yes. It creates a low pressure. A low pressure cooking environment, and it also creates a slow convection cooking environment. On I gotta tell my you stove top. On your stove top. And Can induction friendly. Gas, glass, induction, or electric. No matter what your stove top is, everybody's going to love this. Now, I'm going to get a couple of dishes started quick because I want you to see how fast this works. And then we're going to talk about this pan. And I'll tell you, Kitchen HQ again has knocked it out of the park. So guys, let's get started. Let me show okay, you some of the ways good. this is gonna change what you do in the kitchen. First things first, I want you to watch this, okay? You wanna talk about saving time? Imagine not having to heat right, the okay, pan up if you didn't. Oh, go All ahead right. there, absolutely. I'm let's feeling check it brave, out. <laughs> I'm feeling brave. Nice okay. and cool. All right. The burner's off, so here's what we're gonna do. We're I gonna do take... not have hands of steel. Oh my goodness, look at that. Maybe nurse of steel, depending on the show. Now the but... asparagus has all hit the ground. <laughs> okay. So I'm gonna put that on a cold pan. Julie Child would say, go ahead. We didn't see the asparagus hit the floor. That's funny. So I'm gonna go ahead, guys. I'm actually gonna turn it on now. So now, you don't have to work with a cold pan. I just right. wanted to show you that you could. Hey, Mark, so, can I ask you something? So sure. I heard that click. So that's yeah. that seal. That's that creating. magnet that I'll talk to you about in just okay. one second. So I'm okay. going to go ahead now and we are going to get... They're, they're playing my song. We're gonna get the steaks in a hot pan, okay? I want you to see all the different cooking variations and all the ways that this is gonna change the way that you look at things in the kitchen because it's gonna change the way that you eat as far as the time that it takes because this speeds everything up, which I love. Because so I'm gonna go ahead. Because it's creating that low pressure uh, exactly. seal, basically. Exactly, so let's talk about that, yeah. all right? Yeah, okay, perfect. So we've got our dishes cooking here. Let's walk through this pan, kind of like you did in the beginning, all right? To your point, you've got your grill on the bottom, grill pan on the bottom, and a grill pan on top. And what we've done is we've put the two together. Now, before I close this, you mentioned this seal, and right. this is very important. When we close this pan, that seal is what helps create that uh, low pressure cooking environment. And by the way, that snap that you hear are the two rare earth magnets built into the handle that hold this snap together. And as we look on the bottom, Shannon, on both bottoms on both sides, have a look at this. You have that honeycomb heat grab design. Now, what that's designed to do is create space between your glass top and the pan to really pull that heat in. And okay. talking about heat, yeah. you are looking at a complete die cast aluminum pan. That means that every square centimeter of this pan is designed to disperse heat. Right. So you've got a pan that heats up fast, heats up even, and creates a small oven on your on your on your uh, cooktop. Now, how do I know this? Yeah. How do you know? Because that? we went ahead and we baked a cake. <gasps> oh, that's so fun! <laughs> I love that. As soon as you understand that you've got the cooking environment on your stovetop that you need to make a moist, delicious, beautiful cake, look at this, I can barely get it out of the pan, then you really understand all of the options oh that you've got. Look at how moist that is. That you know what? Gorgeous. Let's just decorate it and serve it in the pan. Let's do that. All right. <laughs> I'll tell you, you know I need what? You can serve from it too, folks. It's live TV. <laughs> look hey, at that, you guys. Uh, by the way, Winnie, you, uh, you, again, you just empty that little tray on the ice maker. Ronnie, great to have you here. Sonia, Sonia great to have you here. Christina, um, the cover is not sold separately yet on the ice maker, Love hopefully. Shakira, happy vacation to you, my goodness. And honestly, we see you there. Uh, Juliet, you really don't have to clean out the ice maker, you just drain it. Hey to Christina. And you know, the thing is, Mark, mm -hmm. I think for a lot of people, right. if, if you have dexterity issues, first Absolutely. of all, I appreciate the fact that it heats on both sides, yep. so I'm not gonna be trying to you know, manhandle pans longer right. at the stove top. I love the idea that it makes my food taste moist Absolutely. because it's got that low pressure well, seal. Well, and it keeps, it keeps that moisture inside, and it that does. really is the key. Yep. Um, you gotta remember the, the, the concept behind a pressure cooker. A pressure cooker, once you close that lid and create that seal, what it does is it forces all of the taste and flavor of the spices that you put in there and the different vegetables deep 
seep into the flavor of the it, food. Right, so it, it infuses. Exactly. And you kind of have to kind of rethink how you think of your stovetop because with that low pressure seal, okay. We're going to flip. We're going to flip. Uh, flip. Remember. Flip the pan, not the food. And I want you to see something here. We literally oh, put those steaks mark. in wow. minutes ago. Now, Shannon, I need everybody to stop just for a second and Holy think about cow. what they just saw. Yeah. Minutes ago, literally minutes ago, minutes maybe ago. two and a half to three, this steak went in raw. Have raw. a look at the crust, have wow. a look at the grill marks. This is out of this world cooking. So let me go ahead and close that nice. for the final couple of minutes. Okay. Right? And by and the that's way, 49.95. This is its debut here at HSN. Uh, in fact, I got a, a moment to test drive it last night because uh, I was hungry when I was oh, got off the air. comparing recipes. Uh, no. <laughs> you know, talk about you know food fight. Marlo's got a food fight. We got a live food fight going oh, on. I love oh, that. What is that? Now I want you to watch oh, this, yum. Shannon. You had done this off the top. The top and the bottom actually separate. They are two pans in one. When you combine them is when you get right. that great low pressure cooking environment and slow right. convection. So let's say that you have a dish okay. like this incredible pot roast yeah. that you don't want to hide from everybody. It's pull apart, guys. This is absolutely unbelievable. Really and the entire pretty. thing, remember, cooked on the stove top, all right? Wow. So we've got for you, if you want, nice. a lid that actually fits on either half with a vent so now you expand we your do. cooking options even more. Hey, by the way, we're world. gonna give you that item number in just a few moments, but I, you know, we're all cramped for time. I know I did bougie lemonade. Yeah, that was a little <laughs> fussy, but last night I did frozen shrimp in this pan on my ceramic glass top range yep. in four minutes from frozen. Look at that. Four nice. minutes from frozen, guys. That's now fantastic. I preheated you know, both sides of the pan, but Mark, you said I don't have to. No, you don't right? have to if you don't want to. So now. Remember, not only do you have a couple of pans up here, now you're also replacing your panini maker. And I'm gonna go ahead and close that down. And remember, you flip the pan, not the food. Right. That keeps everything safe and easy. Now our steak, believe it or not, if you're a steak lover, to think about the fact that this steak could possibly be done oh, listen, that fast is almost out of this world. So I'm gonna go ahead wow. and shut that off. And I'm gonna let this steak rest okay. because I'm not a jerk <laughs> and nobody cuts steak before it's time. Let's be honest here. You <laughs> are the meat man, which by the way, you're also very social. What's going on with you in your kitchen? Well, you know what? We've got a lot of stuff that we love to do outside uh, on, on our online program called Marks on the Grill. Yeah. We, uh, we tackle a lot of our brand new products on HSN like this, uh, put them through the ringers, put them through the test before we get on air, and really give you a, a bunch of uh, you know recipe ideas that we might not have time for here. So now, the one thing I haven't touched upon yeah, clean up. is the surface. Yeah. All right? Okay. You are looking at one of the finest ceramic surfaces you're ever going to find in the industry, you guys. It, the cleanup is nothing. Nothing sticks to it. But here's the cool part about hey, this. Hey, one quick thing. Mark, you yep. said ceramic. It is PFOA and PTFE-free. PTFE. Exactly. So FYI. Now, before I get into the rest of it, because I, I got to keep an eye on this stuff because things cook quick. <laughs> I too. You saw us put this in a cold pan. Think about that. Think was, about the time cold. you'll save. And you're going to flip the pan, not the food. So let me point this towards the front here. We're, we're working a little awkward today because everything we're working backwards so you can see right. it. Oh, Mark, that's okay. beautiful. Again, <gasps> take just a second. Wow. If you're a novice cook, if you're new to cooking, if this kind of scares you a little bit, I put this in a cold pan. So a not only do I pan. not have to know how to cook fish, I don't know how to turn the stove on first. Uh, uh, you know what? I'll tell you what. <laughs> this is someone, a novice's dream. By the way, Maria, hello to you. John, hello to you. And Julie and Julieta and Sharon and Maria. Bill, love you. And Chandra as well. Al says hi to you, Mark. Hey, Candy, hey. you know I love you. Say hi to your hubby. Love having you here. Selene and Darius. All of you really make this your kitchen. And, and I think the big thing about this show that we try to do is mm -hmm. yeah sometimes we get fancy sometimes I get bougie but at the end of the day right I'm a wash and wear kind of girl tell you what let's get it done Jimmy's and get stretch it finished pants really and a box cake any day <laughs> I love it but I you, got some flipping to do here but you can fancy it up and the fun thing about the flip pan is it makes us better cooks because remember of that low pressure seal it is ceramic that I know a lot of us are looking for in our cookware so yeah. PFOA and PTFE free it works pretty much on every range because we've got these are induction ranges that Gas, we have glass, up here. induction, and electric. There you go. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put our little slider type burgers, which by the way, are pretty much done. Now here's the cool thing about the flip pan when you're making burgers. No longer do you need to have to sit there and wait for the cheese to kind of melt on its own. Now you have 
Again, that slow yep. convection and environment. Now you're seal. melting these cheeses and you hear these seals. You know what I mean? It's true. Hey, by the way, we only started with a couple thousand of these. My red is the most limited. So remember, your choices, this blue, this gray, the red. You could almost look at it as three pans because remember, these separate. Now that makes it easy for cleaning. Also, you can use them as two separate pans. One's a griddle, one's a grill. And then, of course, they go together to form that low pressure seal, that low exactly. pressure oven, basically, on your stove top. John, I don't know if you heard Mark or not, but yes, it will work on a gas range. Judy, Judy is also asking if she uses it on a gas stove, will she get the same result, Mark? Absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely Judy. Absolutely. Remember, we've put that special honeycomb bottom on the uh, on the cookware that you find on a lot of the higher end cookware sets out there because what it does is it grabs the heat from your heat source. Again, doesn't matter where it is, gas, glass, induction makes no difference. So we're going to go ahead and build this uh, double burger here with a little bit of a, a bun in the middle because that's for sure. how we like to do uh, things I, here. And I love it. Shakira, for you. Shakira knows about her meat. She said, let the meat rest, hashtag. Josh, hello to you. Diana, thank you. We'll always try to give you great ideas. And Alicia, I'll work on some diabetic and sugar-free foods for you as well. Uh, Vicki loves the pan. No need to season. Sandy's asking, can you do pancakes in this, Can Mark? you ever? I'll tell you. Remember, okay. you're going to flip the pan, not the food. And I think we're ready to do that over here. We've got our paninis happening. Now, remember, right. when you're doing paninis and clothes sandwiches, not only are you toasting the outside of that bun, but unlike a regular pan, because you've created that low pressure cooking environment, and by the way, you want to see a low pressure cooking environment, yeah. give me two seconds after this, watch what's okay. going to happen. So here is your grill marks happening on your panini, oh, nice. nice and brown, put that garlic butter on top. Remember, you flip the pan, not the food. Let's check out our French toast, and I'm going to say that one more time. Remember, you flip the pan, not the food. Not so the food. <laughs> if you don't have the confidence in the kitchen right. with a spatula or a flipper, that's okay. You can go ahead and get it done anyway. Now listen, everything happens here quick. We got a little uh, we got a little dark there, but that's all right. Guys, you're it gonna find the fast. feel for it. Everything's going on here. It, but here's true. where we're gonna blow your mind. Okay. Ready for this? You wanna talk versatility? Yeah. You wanna talk doing things in this pan <gasps> that you don't oh. think that you're gonna be able to be able to accomplish. Okay. How about fried Vicky, chicken? Vicki Lee, he read your mind. She was talking, you can low press chicken, there it is. Well, this is what we're talking about, guys. Uh, there's a famous uh, chicken place out there. Can't really mention the name, but uh, <laughs> I'll tell you, I think you probably know what it is. And the bottom line with it is they're famous because they pressure fry their chicken. Right. That's why their meat has that flavor deep inside it. Because when you close this and let those two rare earth magnets do their job and let that seal do its job, you create, number one, that yeah. slow convection environment, but number two, you create the ability to do dishes like this that you saw me start yeah, in, in a cold pan, Shannon, Absolutely. and that's the deal, boy. Uh, Danny's asking about French fries. You know, I don't know, you know, French fries, I'm, you, you could do them certainly, but if you want them Oh, absolutely, you can yeah. do French fries, well, for look, sure. Listen to the meat man. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, uh, and have a look Reggie, here. Reggie, hi to you in Orlando. Michelle, hi to you, and happy birthday to your mom. Uh, oh, Mark, there you go. I gotta reach across and do Beautiful. this steak. Okay. This was we gotta done go, Mark. in minutes. We gotta go, Mark. Love okay. It. Gotta go, gotta go. All right, by the way, <laughs> Mark has the gram. I have the gram. Mm -hmm. Do you uh -oh. have the gram? You have the gram. You have the gram. You have to have the gram. <laughs> Hashtag your kitchen with Shannon Smith. <laughs> we have it. the gram. We have the meat. We, we have, have the, the grill. We got it all, man. Speaking of grills. I'm going outside. Me too. All right, I love you. I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> okay, by the way, I also love It Cosmetics. I'm actually so happy to be doing, doing one of their shows. Actually, tomorrow night at 11 o'clock, you know we'll be featuring their clinically proven skin-loving solutions. You can actually shop their brand new collection right now on hsn.com. I'll actually be uh, working Working with It Cosmetics tomorrow night at 11 it, as we do our little warm-up act for the brand new Tan Lux today's special. We're going to feed the crew, William, if that answers your question. We're going to the great outdoors. Stay, it's your kitchen. Stay here. This is not just an ordinary scented candle. This is about experiences. 25 years ago, when we launched our first home fragrance brand, we quickly became the number one luxury home fragrance brand around the world. I worked with master perfumers to create top notes, middle notes, bottom notes. When you burn my candles in your home, you never smell one moment. I'm so excited to be coming to HSN. It's the network premiere of Homeworks by Harry Slatkin. If it doesn't follow and pass this sniffer, it's not coming to market. 
The thing I love most about shopping at HSN. Do I have to pick just one? I'd have to say FlexPay. Mm -hmm. It allows me to get the things I want now and make monthly payments without any interest or fees. I got a new mattress for the guest bedroom, a fabulous cookware set for my sister's wedding, and a little something just for me. FlexPay gives me the flexibility to buy what I need now without the stress of having to pay for it all at once. And no interest. Beat that layaway. up and you're looking to impress your friends, let me show you how to make this beautiful seafood boil using my DuraPan. Let's do seafood for the dinner party. Live, it is your kitchen. Look who I found. 27 years, coach, and you turned a passion into a huge business that everybody's in love with. Um. And I gotta tell you something, not only last show, but if you are looking for the biggest, the most unique, the most juicy burger, in my own opinion, on the planet, okay, I'm with working. shrimp, eight, count them, eight of these fabulous four ounce burgers. They come to you frozen. There is auto ship, by the way, because they overnight these, you know, they come to you super duper fast on ice. You defrost them and you get pure product, really pure burger. Tell you what, the only call they have to make on the field this time, uh, coach, is to call the number and get what we got left, Absolutely right? Absolutely no, no. So you've got a very unique product yeah. here. Describe what it is. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Okay. We're gonna go three stages. This is number one. Okay. Now this is how much shrimp is in that shrimp burger. And I just want you to look at that. You're looking at about 12 or 15 shrimp. Okay. Now once we hand make it, then we <gasps> do this. Oh, so these are hand made. Hand made. Yeah, because you notice you don't see like cut edges. or no. they, they don't look all formed. You can tell that's hand formed. made. Formed, yeah. So basically that's all shrimp. I see. Yeah, that's why I wanted to show I the mean, look beginning. At it. So I don't know about you, but when you make a meatloaf, when you make a burger, when you right. make a patty, I mean, what are we doing? We're putting binders, pieces, parts, Well, kale. there you go. We see, I no mean, binders in here. No Just binders. About no 2%. Two percent. That's all. About okay. 2%. No chemicals. No chemicals, chemicals in the shrimp. Chemical free. Chemical free. Now. And don't forget, it is for this show. It's part of our Extra Flex Pay event. It's less than $20 on your credit card. This was a late-breaking addition to uh, your kitchen because, you know what? When you have a party, because our theme tonight is a party, there's always someone who, you know, burgers are great. We love our sliders, but there's always someone who, who wants seafood on the menu. There's already somebody who wants a, a fish alternative. Yes. And when I said this is not like fish, this is not your mama's burger anymore, it is it is so fun, so fantastic tasting. Coach, one of the things that you do that I think is so smart, because it's basically pure product, and, and if you're, you know... I say two points, two points, two points all day. Right. You can actually section these out and create other little meals. Oh, yeah. Meals. See, right now we're doing a little shrimp taco. A little shrimp taco here. We're going to take a couple of strips and cut it up. I had one of my friends say, Coach, I couldn't believe you did that. Yes. I said, oh, yes. Yeah. So we're going to just do it. Now, the last time I had the coach's sauce that's right here. Right. That you can accompany with your product. There on you go. HomeShoppingNetwork.com. And what we're going to do is we just gonna drizzle a oh, little Coach nice. Joe's sauce on that taco. You know, you know, you're making my producer, Catherine, hangry. Well. She's hangry. Because Ca Catherine's yeah, we, got, you all know if you, you know, you know what hangry is. Catherine's hangry because she's got a four hour shift. She's well, on for three hours well, after Well, Catherine, me. here we go. Let's, we got to feed Miss Catherine. Well, I'm going to make her a salad right here. <laughs> you know, just a Coach Joe's shrimp burger salad. Oh, man. 
put it right over these greens real pretty for you. Isn't that great? Uh, by the way, Vicki, good eye. That was the Curtis Stone induction burner that we were using on hsn.com. Joyce, hello to you. Uh, honestly, we are still, Alicia even says, that's a lot of shrimp. Christina's asking, can I put this in an air fryer, Coach? Absolutely. I have Christina, a lot of my yes, customers that put it in the air fryer at home. I know. See, Selene is hangry, too. And uh, now, Candy, I love you, too. What do you got going on Let here? me give you a few things, some pointers, too. Um, I'm just making a mess. My wife's going to get on me. Your nine-year-old daughter is... Oh, yeah, she picked that because the last show my head was shining. And she said, Daddy, you look like a moon pie on there. I love you, But it's coach. all right. Now, all right. how about you trying this burger? Okay, you know I have to. Yeah, you got to do it. So how about let's do that Oh, now. by the way, the, the sauce that Coach... You know what, Coach, can I feed some of my crew, too? Oh, well, let you me fix them right up. Do you want to do gonna that for me? I'm going to take care of the crew. Yeah, we're going to take... So here's oh, the we'll sauce that Coach Joe was just talking about. It's the perfect, you know party compliment, if you will. So that is also available. And Coach Joe, oh, yeah, uh, no we, kidding. Oh, look at you. We're going to take care of the crew I right now. This. Okay, you guys ready? I'm going to feed everybody, Coach. Please you, feed You get the another crew. one. Yeah, okay. I'm coming. Selene, I'm on it. Selene, I know you're on Facebook Live. Consider this your, your shrimp burger. I'm sorry. I wish, okay. You know what? You hungry? All right. Let's do that. Thank you. Yeah. Keith. Here now, we are. This, by the way, I was talking to Keith last night. He was on handheld Here we for go. me. Keith, come on. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yeah, He's let's go ahead and. Uh, okay, we gotta feed care. everybody. Okay. We gotta feed everybody. I know. I exactly. It. All right. Keith, wow, look at Keith's like this was not in my job description. Raise it. You know how they used to say, pass the plate. All right. Oh. Uh oh. 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 Uh oh. Oh. Well, coach. let me. Uh, let come me go on. Back. Give a girl some love. Let me get back on give the point. Give a girl some let love, Let me get coach. back busy now. I'm gonna be in trouble you now. You are. Okay, I gotta try me a bite yeah, of this. Please, okay. you. I've right. been waiting for you to try it now. Talk to me now. Oh, that's good. You just taste shrimp, don't you? That's all I taste is shrimp. Just shrimp. And you're talking about Look at that. 20 grams of protein, mm. one fat gram, zero sugar, and 130 calories. Oh, wow. And seven grams of carbs in that burger. Now, what else can you do with that? I don't have to I mean, feel guilty about that. Huh? I mean, that's wow. crazy. But you know what's so interesting about this? When I say, because we're throwing a party tonight, and thank you guys, I, you know how much I love you. Uh, it's, it's just so fun that you realize this is your kitchen. But it's fun that? when you think, I'm throwing a party, I want something different. Coach, the best part of this is you look like a hero, but you don't come up a zero. You don't have to try to make this work. No, it no, works no, out no, of the no. It's just, it's just shrimp mm. and a four ounce burger. Oh, wow. Mm. I believe you kind of like that, don't oh, you? Oh, real good. Shannon, I, I believe you, I believe it passed. But I just want our customers to check mm. this out and mm. just get us a close up on this just so you can see the shrimp mm. in there. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. Oh, so when my we say goodness. shrimp burger, we mean shrimp burger, not yes. a cake, not a pie. Just a shrimp. burger. Uh, by the way, Linda, so good to see you there. Uh, Alicia, we're going to work on two hours. Jan, thank you. I love you guys so much. Linda, great question. Can I put these on a stovetop? So yes, you can. Yes. Okay. Yeah, you can take a skillet and just pan fry them. Right. Or you can even bake them in the oven. You uh, bet. So it's very versatile. Now, <laughs> when we used to do festivals, I have a Blackstone grill, three of them. We cook them on the Blackstone. Oh, isn't that funny? And sometimes what we used to do, we would deep fry them and then put them on the smoker. Oh. Now, you ain't had anything until you had a smoked shrimp burger. Wow. So, uh... Well, that's a good tip. In fact, my friend Candy, who's watching with her husband, she even <laughs> said, is it a crispy crunch or a softer shrimp? Kind of depends on how you cook them. Like it's a, how you want it. it like, so my wife likes to cook hers crunchy. Yeah. Or you can cook it soft. It just depends. Now, this griddle is a little warm, but if you wanted to cook it in your oven or pan fry, oh, man, you can coach. just do it that way. You know what, and you know what's so interesting, and again, I, I can't, you know, I'm trying, it's a feast for your eyes. You could even take little lettuce leaves, if you wanted to do the whole no carb thing, and wrap it around, right. and well, just. Well, just like the salad. Yeah, just like the salad. You just put on the salad, Absolutely. because you only have seven grams of carbs. Yeah, two points, so, two points, two so points all keto, day. So you keto, or, you know, you're exactly. doing, watching your calories on carbs, yeah. you just. <laughs> Seven grams of carbs on a shrimp burger. Exactly. By the way, my girlfriend from Kongsvinger Lutrin in Donnelly, Minnesota. Hi there, Christy. I love my girl. Uh, William asks a great question. How long does it take to cook, uh, chef? Four minutes chef aside. Coach. Four minutes aside. <laughs> Just four minutes aside from thought. Awesome. And a little oil or whatever butter. But you, I like butter, you know. I'm but with if you, you there. just want to lose a little olive oil, just about four minutes aside. There you go. Remember, eight of them. Eight four-ounce burgers. Uh, we do have auto ship. 
more limited though, of course, delivered right to your door. You get a little break. I can't wait to see what you come back with. Oh, I got some stuff for you. Oh, now. he's planning things. <laughs> the party continues. Blackstone girls, man, I've been using them for a good while now. I love them. They're very portable. You know, these legs collapse up. It stores in the back of my Jeep. There's no compromise. It works just as well as anything in my restaurant would. I would want one of these for my house. I have a lot of cookers, I have a lot of grills, and I have a lot of smokers. But I want my steak to taste like it came off the Blackstone. I want my burger to taste like it came off of the Blackstone. You know what? You can't have a party without Mark Gill. Look at him with his big smile. <laughs> Get the <back> stuff. <laughs> I, love, I love a good photo bomb. Hey, we see you guys Facebook and live. I'm having so much fun. I hope you are. Remember, I will be posting recipes after the show. If they don't happen within 24 hours, they will happen in the next couple days because they're all done. I just need to spell check. There is no spell check. That. There is no edit function for Mark or I. And uh, it's a good thing because we're starting our own little food truck out here. And what I think is interesting about Coach Joe, he even said, his business after coaching football yep. was a food truck. And then That's people awesome. loved his product so much. That's what he, I want to do when I grow up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but he said, too, he uses a Blackstone grill. What we are doing is the secret of all those food shows, right. all those diners, all those best burger in America. Right. And the thing is, this is really a superhero product. A rave customer reviews. Right. Mark, I don't care if you're doing breakfast, lunch, and dinner, eggs and bacon, all day right pancakes steaks <laughs> if you don't know your neighbors yet get ready yep the this, party is coming to you this is anything anytime anywhere the Blackstone means yeah. everything that your grill can do and a thousand things it can't. You've seen the vegetables aren't falling through my grill plates, anything like that. And I've got the ability now to make some of these dishes that have been out of bounds in our backyard and our campsites. And one of them is the one you're seeing here. Now, yeah. if you're like me, yeah. you will fight to the death <laughs> for grill marks. You'll just do it because that's where the flavor is. That's where all the fats and the sugars caramelized. Well, come here. This is why <laughs> steakhouses insist on flat toss because you're not oh, fighting for a grill right. mark. You've got a full side sear, Shannon. That's what we're oh, talking isn't about. That interesting. You're right. Okay. You, uh, by the way, Selene, Coach Joe's sauce that we put on the shrimp is available online. Vicki is, she's a huge fan of the griddle already. Okay. She says love we it. love ours. And do you know what, Vicki? You took the words out of my mouth. She's like, free shipping is a huge bonus because this is heavy. Mark, I'm just going to pop down yep. here for a second just to show what everything that, that Vicki is talking about. Sure. Now, you got to remember, I got back problems. So I'm, if I struggle, it's because I got back problems. And I have no but, manners. I'd be yeah. ready to help. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have a man in the house? He Can left. I get some manhandling over here for God well, this, out loud? That's the real deal, it's boy. That's heavy deal. stuff. I'm actually going to put it down. It, it is. So, stuff and burning. Incidentally, if you're looking at this, you're saying, are they selling two different colors? Take we'll, a picture. We'll that, get to that. We'll that has to, to do that. with the seasoning for sure. Now, Absolutely. all of this is happening on a 22-inch on a slab okay. of cold rolled seal. You know what this is pretending to be? Nothing. This is the real griddle experience. And I'll tell you, this is a griddle top Whoa. that you can literally treat like it owes you money. Well, your knife doesn't right? stand a chance you. against this Absolutely thing, Absolutely right? not. This is the toughest grill you're ever going to put your hands on. This is designed for years and years and years of reliable use. And there are over a million blacks sold already in this country wow. and you are looking at the version that we launched right here on the network so when it comes time for these incredible meals when it comes time to complete that outdoor kitchen of yours and really 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 open up the doors to some of the fun you can have in the back I'll tell you man the Blackstone is absolutely where it's at it, it absolutely is Candy you're absolutely right I know when guys on the air with Mark he always talks about hibachi or Japanese food yeah and we'll that's just it. I mean seriously <laughs> That could have a whole. <laughs> we'll light an that, onion that, up later. That, that's a whole. We're gonna light onions show, up Mark. later. <laughs> All right. Uh, by the way, just so everybody uh, and Mark's gonna get to you know a tour of the unit in just Absolutely. a moment. But remember, uh, Mark came in for me, so we got that special six flex pay. It's less than thirty dollars. It is also free shipping. Only thing that you supply is your friends. <laughs> the atmosphere and your own propane. Right. So you are set to create that party. Mark's going to talk about the seasoning because it's exactly Absolutely. what your favorite diner does. Yep. And Mark, I got to tell you, because I love your show. You've got an outdoor kitchen show. I mean, you... <laughs> Mark's say, on the grill. This yeah, is the guy fun. to watch. But you know, at the end of the day, and I, you know I love you, Aww. but the, the, the grill, it's, this is kind of the secret to success. Well, you know, this is, this is just uh, uh, one of those new ways of being able to cook in the backyard that has just right. really taken everything by 
storm. And here's one of the reasons why, you guys. Yeah. Breakfast and brunch. Right. To be able to do what you're about to see on the grill in your backyard is out of this world. And we're going to talk about seasoning uh, okay. for a second. Now, if you've ever worked with cast iron pans, then you know that out of the gate they need to be seasoned. And your Blackstone is gonna be the exact same way, all right? So for the first three or four cooks, you're gonna to want to give it that little coat of oil like you did, or like you would with cast iron, sure. and let it burn off. Right. And what you're gonna find is after about four or five or six of your cooks, this is gonna to start to turn in right. to a literal skating rink. It does. And by the way, pancakes, you know, you, you can go out, you can find the biggest set that you want to find of, of, of cookware. And you're going to fit maybe maybe three pancakes in there. No, you're right. Maybe, you're right? right? You're this right. is designed for dozens of pancakes if right. you want. So we've got a couple eggs going. We've got a few pancakes Beautiful. going if you want here. And these egg rings are really, really handy it's to work so with, funny, too. It's so funny, because we say you can start your own food truck with this. We're actually not kidding no about lie. that, because <laughs> food trucks use this. Hey, by the way, when it comes to even heating, notice that all the pancakes are bubbling yep. evenly. And ready in seconds. And ready in seconds. By the way, William, uh, Mark is going to take you on a tour next, so you can yes. see where and how that propane is hooked up. Uh, and actually, Candy, you are absolutely correct. You can actually use a, a mini, a mini propane tank or well, a larger one. Out of the one. box, this is going to be designed for one of the smaller oh, propane right. tanks, all right. right? That's going to give you about a 90-minute to two-hour cook. Now, uh, available on hsn.com is an adapter hose right. that allows you, like we've done here, yep. to hook it up whoop, to the 20-pound or 20-gallon propane tank, and that's going to give you 35 to 40 hours. Yep. So let me go ahead and okay. clear this off. By the way, Vicky's do... way ahead of me. Vicky, I'll tell you what, you're hired. I'm out of a job. She knows everything. <laughs> I love you. The adapter is available on hsn.com. You'll probably see that item number uh, reflected on the side mm -hmm. of your screen. So, Mark, let me ask you this. Yep. So, you, if you you can go from meat to meat, just season it in between, or how do I? Um, when you get it out of the box, if you want to okay. just do a seasoning round, then what you're going to do is you're going to heat it up to high, yep. and you're going to go ahead, and you're going to put a very thin layer of oil on there, and then you're going to let it burn completely off. Gotcha. Once it stops smoking, you're going to re repeat the process until you're bored or it's totally black, entirely okay. up to you, okay? <laughs> now, you can do it all at once, or you can do it over the course of time as you're cooking with your, with your, uh, with your uh, Blackstone. And always remember to oil your griddle. Listen, we've all been in those roadside diners. We've sure. seen these guys with the crazy hats work. Yeah. Guys, this is your chance to be that at home, to have that kind of experience at home, to be able, again, to do dishes like I'm about to show you okay. that you can't do with other types of cooking equipment. I keep oh, saying, oh, wow. this is wow. everything that your grill can do and a thousand things it wow. can't. It really is. And you know what? Here's the other thing, especially because you, you, it comes with the adapter or the piece for a small propane tank. Uh, and Catherine, thank you. Uh, sadly, we didn't write the, uh, the item number for the adapter for the large propane tank, but we, uh, Catherine found it for me on hsn.com, so I appreciate that. Uh, also, thank you to Vili uh, Vicky and William on Facebook Live. We do have a few minutes left in the show. So, Mark, I know you're making the world's largest omelet there. Uh, and then we're going to show off to William and the gang, be because you can. <laughs> then we're going to show off, of course, the features that, that if Oops. you're looking for the, the nuts and bolts, a little tour of the machine, and then... Thank you to my <laughs> kitchen boo, big. my ultimate number one Shanita, the one and only Victoria, who I'm going to post the backstage scene of us trying to figure out my cell phone <laughs> steady cam. Get ready, folks. <laughs> it's a whole separate show. No. But she has my mini plates. So I got some feeding to do, and Mark has got some and splaining I'm do a little bit to of do. Explaining. So exactly. here's a little bit. Of so if you're ready. Sauce. I'm going to start feeding everybody. A little bit of cheese. So Let's let me go it. to this machine, okay. and you enjoy your omelet. I will. <laughs> this, is, this is Shannon's size. I, I will tell you that right now. All right, so let's have a peek here, you guys. First things first, when this comes out of the box, if you've ever spent the weekend bleeding and swearing, putting a grill together, I feel you, man. That is a pain that only we know, okay? Out of the box... You're, well, you're looking at three minutes. There's, a, there's two pieces. There's a bottom and the top. And all you're going to do is you're going to line up the four holes right on the side, and they're going to drop right into place. There's your assembly. You pop the knobs on and you're done, okay? Now, this surface, again, I'm going to say it, cold rolled steel. This is designed to last for years and years and years. And look at this. You have two independently controlled heat zones. That's huge. Now you can warm on one side, cook on the other, cook all the way through. 385 square inches or one. It's entirely up to you. And we've given the H burners with this for complete coverage, not a couple of little sticks on either side. That's the way it's done. And the grease trap is at the back of the unit. So you're always pushing the hot grease away from you when it comes time to clean. Everything goes into the grease trap for super easy cleanup. And guys, remember, this comes out of the gate 
ready for you to use with those smaller propane tanks. Start out to finish, uh, Shannon. This is out of this world, let me tell you. It, it is indeed. Okay, like I said. How I've are you got, making out over there? I'm making little mini omelets <laughs> for the crew. Because You're having a good time. everybody's hungry. Oh, that's so, adorable. I have know. 12 giant burgers. You enjoy your little... Uh... <laughs> I will. They don't call it finger food for nothing. I love okay. it. Okay, and I got big old paws, so big I need paws. better... Okay, all right. Yummy, yummy from the grill. Instead of yummy, yummy from the oven, yummy, yummy from your brand new Blackstone grill. Okay. You ready? I don't... Look at... Is it, we, I like this. We've got some takers. That works for me. Okay. Oh, the, the job over there keeps getting better at, and better. Let me tell I'm you. I'm adulting today. That's why I'm actually giving out utensils at the same time. I know. See, thank you. All right. Thank you. We're going to feed you, we're going to feed you, we're going to feed you. It's your kitchen. And thank you again as we Facebook Live. Mark was kind enough to come in for me. This this is famous here. Blackstone really has no peer. I mean, there's... There really is. There's they, nothing like there's, it. There's nothing like it in the industry. I mean, they really are so unique. But... If all you did is burgers, Mark, oh, I'm telling man. you, this every is, day, all day, and twice on Sunday. Look, I know it's cold where some people are, but if you jump up real high, you can see summer coming over that hill, man. And you are looking at every cookout, every summer, every get-together, every ball game, every tailgating guy. That's 12 burgers, giant. We still had a ton of room. Let's talk about the cleanup, and then we're going to get into a little bit of fun, okay? Sounds good. So, guys, what I like to do over here is I kind of like to take everybody on a road trip. And you know what? I always ask, how do you like to travel? Is it by boat? Is it by car? Is it by train? Or do you do what a lot of us do? And do you travel from the comfort of your own living room? Yeah. Right? So you, we see all of these great shows on the uh, on the Food Networks and all of this really cool stuff we can do. But we don't have flat tops. And the griddles that we get for inside have coatings on them. They're, they're meant to be something or emulate something, guys. This is the absolute real deal. So let's go ahead and really start some dishes here on either side. We're going to get that burger going. We're going to get a little bit of a... Uh, different type of burger going here that needs an egg right in the middle because why not there we are because oh, a couple of shells to float not? off I right love it. there we go you know what let's go ahead and get those shells because you right can. out of the way <laughs> because, because you, can. you can now we're going to take this avocado shannon okay and uh here's a little bit of a tip just All go right. ahead and half it and then take a knife and just make a few slices down the middle and then go ahead and just with a spoon or a fork Run your hand around the inside, and now you've got a perfect avocado that we can grill and put on that burger, okay? We've got some bacon that we're going to heat up a little bit, a sausage okay. that we're going to put in the corner, and we're going to go to the grill beside it here. Sounds good. And we are really going to make an iconic dish. Now, the I mean, the most famous flat top, top dish that I can think of is a Philly cheesesteak. Oh, right? amen. And if you've ever been... Okay, what's the argument, though? Well, you know the fight. What is it? Is it what? that one over there? Is it that one over there? Do you want a wit? Do you want a... Who's oh, got the onions? best one, this? Mark? Well, you know what? I'm going to tell you who's got the best one. What's your address? Because now, by the way, let me put the chili on over here. That's pretty cool to be able to do that. Because now you've got the tools that they have. So when it comes time oh! for that real fun and just to really kick it up and have a good time like you see these guys doing, this is the kind of experience that you don't get with any other piece of a co uh, cooking equipment. It's the reason that it's become such a hit here. It's the reason that it's got so many five-star reviews. It's the reason that I, uh, even though I have 14 grills in right. my backyard, 80% yeah. of the food that I make comes off my Blackstone, guys. Yeah, this is true. the real deal. It is indeed. Hey, by the way, Alicia wanted some bacon, so I am going to post some for her. Nice. Uh, I, I honestly can't bring it right to your home, and forgive me if I can't spell check without my readers. <laughs> you know, but I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. Okay, here we go. Didn't get old, great. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> mm, it's fantastic. I love it. So, love all right, it, uh, it. Catherine, that should be there in just a moment. Alicia wanted some bacon. Alicia, I'm sending you some bacon. All right. Mm, bacon. So, so here we bacon. go. Everything's better with bacon. Everything is better with bacon. Okay. So let's so, go ahead. And we're going to make See? our couple of sandwiches here. Now, this is where, again, if you love getting creative in the backyard, if you love opening up your world uh, to, to all kinds of new cooking experiences, whether you're tailgating, whether you're camping, whether you got people over for Sunday brunch or it's just you on a Wednesday night, this is such a cool way to do it. It, it so, is. Oh. Alicia, there's your bacon. Bacon. <laughs> bacon, pancakes, eggs, you know, hamburgers. You <laughs> I did. I did. So I love that's it. That's the closest thing I can come to bringing it directly to your door. 
There you go. <laughs> Alicia, darling, that is for you. Uh, honestly, we love that you guys are here. And we try to make the show fun, as many of you know. But we also try to give you some practical ideas. For sure. And I think the neat thing for me about this is, listen, I can post recipes and things and stuff all day long. But at the end of the day, if you don't have the right tools for success, they, I'll just tell you, and I know Guy has talked about this on the air because he's owned several restaurants. Mm -hmm. there, nothing replaces a Blackstone grill. grill. I mean, there's, it, it's just, it's so unique in terms of what it does. Mark, tell them again the size and it's cold rolled this steel. This is 22 inches of cold rolled size. I just got to put a little cheese on my burger here if you don't mind. Yes. This is 22... Oh, oh <laughs> isn't that sizzle? Christina's so funny. There she wants some too. Right. Uh, Lydia, I know we're making you hungry. Uh, Selene now wants a cheesecake. Uh, Christopher's <laughs> asking, this is a good, it's a valid question. Can this be used inside? Even though no. It's, okay. It's a propane uh, based unit. You don't want to use anything go, that's propane inside because right. it does give off an exhaust that, you know, maybe our house can't handle. So just to walk through real quick before we go check out the Philly cheesesteak. Oh, People fight that. over oh. that thing, I promise I you. I wish we had smell vision man. <laughs> don't you? <laughs> Most days. So, <laughs> Guys, this is 22 inches, again, of cold rolled steel. I'll say it again, treat this top like it owes you money. There's no rules, there's no anything. This is everything your grill can do and a thousand things it can't, all right? You've got two H burners underneath with individual heat controls. That means that you have full coverage cooking. You can go ahead and cook, uh, you, you know, cook your heart out on one side, warm on the other. You can keep everything just kind of sizzling. You can keep it all simmering. It's completely up to you. The stainless steel is gorgeous on the front. The Beautiful. piece looks really great. It's tabletop. You can bring it anywhere. You've got those two independent controls. We give you the setup that you need out of the box for those one to two gallon propane tanks. Right. So you've got a 90 minute to two hour cook. Gotcha. And then we've also got the ability for you to add on that, uh, that uh, adapter hose. Right. And that's going to give you a 35 to 40 hour cook. I'm, I'm talking really fast because my cheese steaks are burning. <laughs> He's got to go. Uh, so I know Catherine will show you the item number four, that adapter. We will show you that again. Uh, it is available on hsn.com. Love it. But when we say at the end of the day, you know what? It's not a party un unless people are happy. And th every time I do this item, I mean, everybody on the crew, uh -oh. everybody's happy. There's it's, something I'm, I'm about that smell. There's no <laughs> bad days with the Blackstone grill. All right, here we go. It's cheesesteak time. And Whoa. I ask you this again. Hey, now. Who's got the best one? Is it the guy in that corner, the guy in that corner? or you. Guys, you can do this. This is easy. Oh, man. There's Mark. nothing to this. All it's right, let me so go ahead funny. and get the other one just uh, like William this. William on Facebook says Isn't you're that beautiful? hired. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be there, man. He's like, he's hired. Listen, we are all about food, family, fun, and any chance that I have to get it's together true. and cook for friends, neighbors, uh, buddies like Shannon, I'm all over it. It's why we love what we do. It's why pieces like this exist is so you can get together and show love it, through it, food in ways true. you've never been able to do before. Okay, honestly, we're going to have to go to the phones quickly. Hi there. You are live on the air at H. HSN, it's Shannon and Mark. What's your name and where are you calling from? Um, this is Michelle Gonzalez. Hello. Hi there. Was it Michelle? From Dallas, yes, Michelle. I think. Hi, Michelle in Dallas. Do you go. already own the Blackstone Griddle? No, I just purchased two of them. Wow. Michelle, are you starting your own there food you truck? <laughs> Watch your fingers. <laughs> Watch fingers, there we go. Now, Michelle, you gotta oh, try no, this Sam, burger. I just wanna learn how to cook all these things that he's making on there. <laughs> Looks so good. You know Don't what? they? Uh, if you ever decide to make a burger like this, Michelle, go ahead and let that cheese sit for about 30 seconds, and then you'll be able to shape it any way you want. You could there turn you it go. into a little bowl, you could turn it into anything. This is a great way to have Absolutely. a burger. Absolutely. Hey, Michelle, I know we are, we're short on time, but we thank you. You're gonna have so much fun. You're gonna meet friends you haven't even, you didn't even know <laughs> no, you had. had. <laughs> and thank you so much for popping by your kitchen. We love you, Michelle. Thank you. Thank you, darling. All right, we're almost out of time, Mark. So right. What do we got to show them? Well, I wanted to skip over here quick because we haven't touched on something that's very important. Yeah. Fish, scallops, Ooh, fish, veggies, right. lemons, they're so good and they smell up your house so much. Yeah. Guys, I don't care how good dinner was on Thursday. By Sunday, you're over it, all right? Yeah, well, so what's this? Not only can you take your favorite uh, recipes that might be a little pungent for inside, outside, sure. but you want to talk non-stick from a seasoned grill. I know we kind of talk as we cook here, but this is a good time for me to pause and say, have a look here. 
this all had the skin on it. Skin side down or flesh side down makes no difference. And just really quick, we keep talking about how special these dishes are yeah. and how you can create things that you can't create anywhere else. And nothing says it better than one of those uh -oh. Japanese steakhouse uh -oh. tapenaki things. Goes. Because this is the kind of thing that I wouldn't recommend you ever oh. do on a grill. But I want you to do it on the Blackstone because this is where grilling's going. It's where grilling is now. This is where griddling is going to take itself to the next level. Whether you are in your own backyard, whether you're camping, whether you're tailgating, whether you're at the football game, whether it's Sunday brunch, whether it's dessert, whether it's a treat, oh, it makes I no I difference. Lost one. This is, should I light it up again? Yeah, light it up again. Light it up again okay, for go. Janet. Fire. All right, here we go. I want to see fire. All right, you want to see go. fire? Put a little more hairspray fire. in there. Here we go. Woo! Back off. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. And remember, you go ahead and treat this bad boy like oh, it owes you man. money everything you need you guys is right here have a look at the reviews nice. check out online and have a look at the blackstone community that's out there and you're going to see people absolutely do. love this blackstone you mark guys. i love you <laughs> i'm posting your 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 little fire tsunami there i love it and come to my party anytime anytime bring man. that i'm there but bring bring that blackstone griddle okay <laughs> okay <laughs> hey by the way oh Look at this. The container that I brought it in was actually too large to transport outside, so recipe of the week time. It wouldn't be a party without a dip. I'm not talking about me personally. I'm talking about something that people can eat and share with the class. So this is my buffalo chicken dip, and uh, of course, oh, and don't forget, I'll also be showing you the uh, chicken waffle sliders a little bit later on as well. Plus, I'm posting the bougie lemonade. I have the naughty but nice peanut butter cake that's coming up. Victoria's like, I know, I know, I know. Oh, oh. Be still my heart. Uh, so there's lots of things going on with us. And of course, you can always check us out. Oh, by the way, where's my dry erase board? Oh, do I have it? Okay, they're like, hashtag, hashtag.com, hashtag. Okay. Here, that's, that's why hashtag I'm your here. kitchen with Shannon Smith. Hold on. I got hashtag your kitchen. Props. Okay, look at, <laughs> gosh, a man who's helpful in the kitchen. It doesn't last. You're like, <laughs> As soon as we get to know each other, I fade off. There you go. <laughs> We're on a budget, folks. What can I say? Thank you. I'm going to eat, my friend. I love you. We love you. I'll see you next week in your kitchen. Oh, and tomorrow night at 11 o'clock with It Cosmetics. Nice. I'm hungry. How about you? I need some foundation. Okay. It's, <laughs> it's time. Here's Adam. <laughs> I'm telling you now, we need the Shannon Smith cookbook. I know you agree. The amazing Shannon with your kitchen. Good evening, everybody. Welcome.